All right, so it's not Earth. It is, in fact, even though it won't tell you, and even though it was a very loose hint, it's on Ceres, apparently. <sighs> That's it's great. Where's Kerr? Let's go there. We're going to be doing the quest solo. Because that's usually the best way to do it. I'm glad that Ceres is like level 15 planet now. Because, you know, that makes sense. Anyway, here we go. This shouldn't take that long. Alright, so these things are like in dead ends or like gross piles of uh, pollution, apparently. Where are they supposed to be? Like, like, what would this plant's natural habitat be? Because this clearly is not the natural habitat. Okay, well, that's one. That's two. Alright. Oh, three. Good. That appears to be all I need. Maybe. Anything else, huh? Not missing anything? Alright. We'll keep an eye out for some more, but... You know. Really seems like we got all we need. Another one. And another one. You know, these aren't so bad. Were these buffed? I really think this wouldn't have been this easy. Or this fast. In the, uh, the first couple days of doing this. I really think... This has been buffed considerably. Because something tells me I'm just I'm doing way too good at this. Unless if I just got really lucky for once, which would be really awesome. Because I can demonstrate that my RNG is typically some of the worst anyone's ever seen. And what's this? <laughs> series. I still haven't completed basic series, really? Alright, well I guess it's time to go finish this reactor sabotage then. We have uh, plenty of plants. One thing that I'm a little surprised by is the fact that you need to actually scan thresh cones and, and garbage like that, which is ridiculous. That stuff hasn't had to use in years. All right, there we go. Where's the exit? As long as they don't lock me in, this mission should be over in just a little bit. What is that noise? Some, something's going on outside. I might have to close my window. I don't know, I'll attest that this, this noise in the background isn't the recording, but it really seems like I might have to close my window on this hot summer day. All right, here we go. That's episode one. I'm just going to go close my window because, you know, why, why have it open? Why be comfortable? Oh great. Do we uh Well I guess it's here, right? Apothic? Oh I didn't know I had a form of blueprint unused. Um Apothic. Where is it? I mean I, I wasn't at my computer when that quest scene was playing, so um I don't know uh, what's going on. To craft a Nightfall Apothic, what? I have five of them, isn't that enough? Yeah, do I have the blueprint then? Let's check the inbox. If you would tell me what I need for that, that'd be nice. 
Thank you. Thank you, not. Alright. N. Nightfall Apothic. Are you serious? Oh. I need Sunlight Thrush Cones. Absolutely pathetic. It's the worst. Fine, we're, we're going to Earth. Whatever. I, I might just go there and, and get freaking Sunlight Thrush Cones and, and just be done with it. This is so dumb. Why, why 12? Why 12? Why not just 1? This is a quest, not a grind. Oh wait, this is Warframe. Everything's a grind, even quest. Alright, where's, uh... Where's the capture? No. No. Was it Mantle? I always thought it was Mantle. There it is. Captures are quick and easy to do. And I don't know what cycle the earth is at right now in game it resets from day to night every four hours so first it's gonna go capture the target and then we're gonna activate our synthesis scanny scannies And we're going to spend all day looking for freaking Thresh Cones. When I have 8 of them already. Why do I need 12? Why isn't 8 good enough? Why do I need to continue to grind even for a quest? Any Kubro eggs? No? Oh well. Too bad. Hey, there's one of these things. It's not a thresh cone, but whatever. I don't even know what it is. It's a... Uh, oh, jade leaf. Okay. Alright, so let's run back. What is that down there? Uh, just a weird texture on a manhole cover. Alright, so this over here was the opening, beginning of the level. Yes, it was. Alright, nothing here. This is going to be a... Uh, Thrilling to watch as I run around searching for freaking thresh cones because that's just you know that's, that's awesome that's what I play Warframe for what the hell is here that I haven't scanned oh a fragment oh here we go two sunlight thresh cones now let's get rid of these false kubros all right jade leaf Oh nice, I can get all the ones I need here. I got all the ones I need there. Oh, one more, why not? Okay, you know what, this wasn't so bad. I This is effectively just needing one if there's that many around. I seem to remember there never being this much around, but you know, whatever. If they want to make it a little bit better in the quest and, and have it. Alright, we're all set. We officially have everything we need to uh, get this out of the way. Also, Galatine Prime. Something I've wanted forever. So something I've wanted before I was even really like into the game. Galatine always seemed like something that would be a, a very favored weapon. But, uh, you know, alas, it wasn't as good as the others. So it wasn't picked over the others. Although, Galatine used to be one of the strongest weapons, according to, uh, to patch notes back when, like, melee charge attacks were, like, the thing you could do all the time. Alright, let's see how long I have to wait for this blueprint to be, uh, cooked in the oven. Yeah, it's nice. Eight thresh cones, not bad.
Come on now. Why not? You already said that. Okay, N for knights, there it is. One minute. Alright, well, I'll see you in one minute.